I could have been watching Housewives if I knew that Beyonce was gonna lose. Grammys, we need to have a talk. When I tell y'all I'm so done with y'all, I'm so done with y'all. I'm highly freaking mad with the Grammys right now because I feel as though I was robbed and I wasn't even invited. I think I've said this in about three of the freaking seven In Bacon's Minds episodes that Beyonce is the person who does it for me musically. If you're not Beyonce, you're not gonna get any reactions out of me. But if you are Beyonce, I will buy your ticket. I will come to your show. I will support your album. I will advocate for you. Whew, tired. Last year, Beyonce released her album, Lemonade. Critically acclaimed, had songs on there. Formation, Hold Up, Sorry, Radio Success, album was only released on title sold on itunes multi-platinum won eight vmas won numerous bt awards numerous naacp awards the visuals are winning then we get to the grammys all right beyonce before this point had 20. second most awarded woman in grammy history she was nominated for nine awards she's also the most nominated woman beyonce really out here running this grammy streets like she out here just getting the grammy my guess was at least four grammys you win four out of nine that's a little bit under half but before the show even starts beyonce won one so i was kind of like okay no not a big deal because these aren't really the big categories we get to the show she wins best urban contemporary album best black album that's just what it is. And then we get to the last 10 minutes of the show. So y'all have me sitting at my TV from 8 o'clock p.m. until almost midnight. I'm really ready for these awards so I can go to bed. Album of the year comes. I'm sitting here, my heart's beating. I'm nervous like I'm the one who about to get freaking nominated. I'm, I'm sitting here looking like, well, maybe is it, is it my turn to go up here? Because I'm really nervous. They call 25. And instantly, my mouth hits the floor. I'm like, what the f How did 25 beat Lemonade? Everybody knows Lemonade should have won that award. Even Adele knew that Lemonade should have won the award. So why the f didn't Lemonade win that award? Three years ago, we was in this same predicament, okay? Against the Beck. So we said, okay, shit still ain't fair. Cool. Next year when we get this Beyonce album, if she sells a whole bunch of albums, then maybe, just maybe, we might get album of the year. But we only know Adele's album for the freaking song, Hello. Beyonce comes up with Lemonade, performs Formation at the Super Bowl, causes controversy, had everybody saying get in Formation, had everybody saying boy bye, and all this stuff, all this culture that she has produced for black women. Hillary lost the election. Falcons lost the Super Bowl. Beyonce loses album of the year. This is too much. What else am I gonna lose? So I knew something was up when Rihanna was nominated for eight or seven Grammys and then win one. Beyonce nominated for nine and only won two. And this is my advice to Beyonce. I don't know if you're gonna watch this. Beyonce, you are too good for the Grammys. You are a black successful woman. You had arguable, excuse me, arguably. You had the best performance last night and people literally watched your performance just to see what you were gonna do while pregnant. Let's be completely and 100 and totally percent honest. Beyonce brings those ratings and anybody who says different, ain't nobody watching for no Keith Urban. Beyonce, don't go anymore, you know, don't go. Let them mail your Grammys. Use your, your brand for rating and then they snub you. And that's not right. You should have cussed them out. You should have pulled your own Kanye. And when Adele ripped that Grammy, you should have went up there and got that piece. It's not like I'm about to cry, but I'm just really, really tired. Like, whew. But they have the nerve to go up there and be like, we're gonna diverse music. All this diverse music. Y'all just started putting rap categories in the main show. Let's be real, y'all don't even go over gospel in the main show. I just don't get it. What do black people gotta do? What the hell do we gotta do to win album of the year? 